What is going on everybody? Mattitude22 coming back at you guys with another video. Today we are looking at the Star Wars Black Series Zuckus figure. Uh, this was a Toys R, Us, a Toys R Us exclusive here in Canada. In the States I feel like it was a Disney Store exclusive. I'm not really sure. But So we got Zuckus today. Uh, pretty simple figure but... Charming nonetheless. Take a look at the packaging right there. So you got, you can see right up front, Toys R Us exclusive. Nice shot of the figure on the bottom right there. Of the character, I should say, on the bottom. Zuckus and Star Wars Black Series right there. This was an exclusive, so not part of the numbered series. So no number. And then nothing on that side. And then on the back, we got another shot of Zuckus with a brief little bio if you want to read that. Guys, of course, feel free. To pause this video now and do so I'll give you another second for that there you go all right so looking at the figure i really i really like this figure and i really don't like it for many different reasons uh the first one the face sculpt is immaculate i love the color i love all the shading just it's kind of like a like a lightish brown it's, it's hard to see because it's so bright the lighting is uh not the best here and then it's got the silver eyes in this part a lot of crevices a lot of sculpting on the head so really nice and we got these little tubes which go all the way to the back i don't know i don't really know zuckus's deal is this like a human in a suit is this an alien i'm not really familiar uh, we got this. I don't really know what that is, but it looks nice. It looks like a little canister of some kind. It's silver, and it's, it's covered in all this stuff. So, very cool nonetheless. And then this chest plate is a separate piece. There is some pockets, none of which are painted. And then we got a nice black robe, or brown robe, I should say. So, talking about the robe, I really love how Hasbro is killing it with the soft goods. For their figures, I really, really think they got to keep it up with this and give us less plastic, give us more soft goods. Uh, I know some people are on the fence. Some people like it the other way, but I, I really think the soft goods is where it's at. And it's just kind of a brown coat with some black on it. Looks really good. Same deal on the back. So this part is silver with a little tube. No paint on this. No paint on the pockets on the back, which are kind of hit and miss. I feel like I could use a little paint. We got the hand, with the three fingers, and boots, just kind of normal boots. And then the only accessory we have is this weird gun. Uh, I don't really know what kind of gun this is. Looks like a shotgun, almost, uh, in, my, in my world. Uh, in my mind, it's, it's some kind of shotgun. And he doesn't really hold it all that well. I, I don't know, unless... Unless I'm doing it wrong, I just can't get him to hold it straight. The finger doesn't seem to go in properly unless you put it at an angle. And then you can kind of get it in. But if you just want to have him holding it like this, which you would normally, he doesn't really hold it properly. So that's kind of annoying. Maybe it's supposed to go in the other hand. But I mean, the trigger finger is on this hand, not on this hand. So I, I don't know. But nonetheless, you can get them in there nice. And the gun is nice, actually. So it's molded in the, in the black plastic. But there is some brown on it. So it does look good. It, it does look good nonetheless. Um, articulation for Zuckus. Head moves side to side, forward and back. Arm moves up to there. Moves in this far. Out that far again. Thanks to the soft goods, no articulation is inhibited. I have a swivel, double-jointed elbow. Feels like we don't, we have a ab crunch, but not really a waist twist. Um, hips move out this far. Again, th thanks to the soft goods, they won't inhibit any of his articulation. Kicks this far forward. This will, on the other hand, but you can just kind of move it out of the way. Moves that far back. Double jointed knee. Ankle rocker and ankle pivot. A bunch of, please ignore that, a bunch of stuff. Just fell down behind me. That's, that's making me ticked off. But 
Anyway, so decent enough figure. I mean, I think the allure of this figure is that if you want to, if if you want to kind of complete those bounty hunters, which like like I'm sure many people I do, then this is kind of a of a of a core piece. You want to have Zuckus. Uh, I don't know how hard it, it it's gonna. I don't know how hard it is to get this figure in the states. If you if you can get this figure, I do suggest it because it is nice. Uh, but if you don't really care about completing the bounty hunters and you could do without this figure, then I say pa easy pass. But that is it for this video, guys. I hope you liked it. If you did, please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. All that good YouTube stuff. Please make sure to check out my social media in the description. Of course, you don't have to, but if you want to, I would appreciate it. Make sure you check out Facebook and this check out this sanctuary on Facebook and on YouTube and head over to Clickbait on YouTube. I will catch you guys there. If not, I will catch you guys back on this channel later on with another figure review. You guys have yourselves a great day and I'll catch you next time. And peace.